Hey everybody, Alex here from Android Headlines and today we're doing two videos in one. We're going to show you how to install apps that are not in the Play Store, also known as side loading apps, and how to install a third party keyboard like Swift Key, Swift Key, Swift Key Flow Beta, which I've already got it downloaded, it's right here, ready to go. But before you can do that, you need to go into settings and down to um security it should be under and check unknown sources and once you've got that taken care of you can go and install the app and now it's installing and it's installed so we're going to click open and now we're onto the part where we're showing you how to install a keyboard, a third party keyboard. So these are the terms of services. You're just going to click accept so you can continue. And then you're going to download your language, which for us is English US. And we just got to wait for that to download. And that's done. We're going to enable Swift key. Now remember you have to use the back key because you're going into settings. And it's enabled. So now we're going back. You have to set it as the default input method. And if you want to enable Swift Key Flow, which we do, and then you can personalize it. If you log into your Gmail, Twitter, or even your RSS feed or SMS, it will pick up your typing habits and pick up your words because it predicts your words for it very well. And here you can go in and customize the theme. Um, I usually use the hollow theme because I really like the hollow themed apps like and then you've got you can check out your stats which of course are going to be all zeros for me right now I just installed it um, you also have some how-to videos and some other stuff you can leave feedback since this is a beta but that's how you install a third-party keyboard on your device and how to install apps that are not found on the Play Store.